The chance for Joy Floyd's name has an entirely new tune to it. I feel relieved today. After the jury found Derek Chauvin guilty in Floyd's death, Floyd's family thanked the public for their role in getting justice. And I want to thank all the protesters, all the attorneys who stepped up, all the activists who stepped up, yes. and many who think they're not activists but advocates. Thank you all. We know we'll never get George back. And that's the sad part. But we are fighting and we're going to continue to fight. Grateful for the people in this world for the support, the prayers, the, the, the love that was shown. Words from the Floyd family followed celebrations in the streets. Carrie Levin also caught up with part of the Floyd family, leaving the Hennepin County Courthouse after the verdict. Yes. I'm going to start with President Biden supporting 100 percent and Vice President and their family and their wife, and they're definitely supporting Stephen Jackson. Starting, yes, they're going to change the world. And just like George Floyd's family, civil rights leaders echoed the same gratitude for all of the support, especially from the youth. Young people, white and black, some castigated, many that are here tonight, marched and kept marching yeah. and kept going. Justice for George means freedom for all. All right. In order to reach that freedom from all, Floyd's family calls the much desired guilty verdicts just the first step towards police reform in the Twin Cities and across the country. Back to you. A first step indeed. All right. Thank you, Steve.